What's going on YouTube? Before this video begins, are you tired of being teamed on in Rogue Demon? Join God's blessing. All you have to do is change your display name to GBX user or GB underscore user to gain access to the wall to request for help. You can also join the Discord server for competitive trainings, events, tournaments, wars. Everything will be linked in the description of this video. This is how you stop getting teamed on. Without further ado, let's get to the video. Yo, before this video begins, I'm making my own Demon Slayer game. I think it's going to be the best Demon Slayer game on Roblox. Not even just because of our development, but because I refuse to allow toxicity in my community. So make sure you guys join that link in the description and in the pinned comments. And in uh, today's video, I actually want to talk more about toxicity, you know what I'm saying? Because every time I play Rogue Demon, I experience toxic people. Every time I hear and look around, I experience people that are just being negative people. And I ask people, how old are you? Well, not I don't ask people how old are you, but let me put it this way. I said, I said, yo, I just turned 18. And somebody said they were so young that it just blew my mind. I'm like, how are you that young playing Roblox, man? Like, Roblox isn't even a kid's game anymore. It's not even safe for the children. And that's why I'm going to dedicate to making games that are tailored towards you know, friendly, friendly um, platforms. And it's going to be hard, especially because my game is going to have thousands of players. But I'm going to have rules and in-game ban rules. You will be banned for having certain amounts of toxicity. What people don't understand is I used to be in the De Hood community. See, before before I met Michael, bro, I was the purest dude ever. I got videos of me uploading on Minecraft and stuff where I didn't even cuss a single time. You know what I'm saying? I, I remember Michael Wilde blowing up my minecraft base seven years ago and i cried i cried when he blew up my base i was like 11 or something i was a very soft kid bro and all these kids the newer generations are being exposed to more and more toxicity and degeneracy and it's like yo people want to make the argument oh that'll make them stronger younger no that'll make them corrupted younger you idiot they need to be around 14 15 years old before they can be truly explained these things and how people actually operate on the internet and how dangerous things can be. You know what I mean? I have personally never doxed somebody in my life. And doxing means you like get their information and post it on the internet, basically, like where they live or whatever. I have never in my life beamed somebody or of any degree, which is like you send them this link and it takes their account. And that's why you all need to be incredibly important if you go on discord if you go on these apps you cannot click links you cannot do anything you have to be incredibly smart and i'm trying to teach you guys these things because man y'all are like my children people always ask yo why are you so mean to your gb members bro first and foremost the members that i'm genuinely unnecessarily mean to are old enough to understand my context and my uh satirical messaging now for my younger members the reason why I'm so mean, and I don't define it as mean, bro. I literally see you guys as my children. And let me explain. Parents don't know what's happening on the internet all the time, man. They can't monitor you guys doing whatever you want. And, you know, you, some of you guys don't listen. You know what I mean? Some of you guys just don't listen. And rightfully so. I didn't listen either. I want to do what I want. But at the same time, bro, they just want to keep you safe. They want to keep you protected. You know what I mean? And, you know, I understand that it's very hard when they have work, they have this and that. They can't just watch you 24 hours a day. And that's why I'm here. And I'm going to make it to where I'm going to make, I'm going to make me my Demon Slayer game. I'm going to make other games. I'm going to make all the games. And I'm going to enforce rules and have heavy moderation that is non-corrupted to keep the Roblox platform what it should have been. Roblox is supposed to be for kids to have fun, make friends. And, and, and enjoy themselves, bro. I enjoy myself on Roblox. Fighting in this game like a little tryhard is fun for me, man. And so at the end of the day, at the end of the day, I have no choice but to spread the best ability of my education. And so it's like, you know, it's what I have to do, bro. I'm sorry. I'm going to have to make my own games that I can protect my own community from because, bro, I can't allow this, man. And I maybe it'll be impossible. I don't know, but I'm going to try everything I can. That's for sure, bro. Because there's no way, it's no way, like, even me, even me, sometimes people say things that genuinely upset me. For example, people try to weaponize my virtue, and you guys don't know what that means, but let me explain it to you. Virtue is like your morals, like, I won't kill anybody, I won't lie to anybody, 
I'll try to love everybody. Those are like morals. Those are like goals that you'd never break. You know what I mean? And people will be like, oh, but you were, but you were toxic here. You were toxic there. Like they'll try to pull up my past and things of that nature. Like I wasn't the most toxic individual ever. And sometimes it, it'd make me want to re result, result. It'd make me want to fall back to the old me. You know what I mean? It'd make me want to be the old me. And uh, that's not good, bro. I should never allow me to go back to old me because I have you guys. I can't disappoint y'all. If I go back to the old me, how are you guys going to learn how to be the best versions of yourselves? If I can't do it, then there's no way you guys can. So you know what I'm saying? I'm going to do whatever it takes to stay on this you know, proper path and things of that nature. I know you guys will probably have me watching, running around, 1v1 and people and things of that nature. But it's very important that I made this video. And I can't speak. I'm not, I don't want to speak on things. I'm not ready to speak on yet because I know a lot of things, but I just want y'all to know that you guys need to, you guys need to open your minds. And what I mean by that is you need to watch every single thing, every single thing that you watch on the internet, every single thing that you read, you need to question it. You need to decipher it. If somebody says, Hey, want to play Roblox with me for three hours? I found this new grinding game. Why are they asking you to do that? Is it because they want you to spend time with them? Or is it because they want you to help them grind something so they could get something out of your time? What do they want? You need to question absolutely everything. If you're on TikTok and you see a short of some stupid chick dancing. Oh, look at me dance. Why is TikTok recommending you that? What are you benefiting from your life from you seeing that? Entertainment? Oh, entertainment. Is entertainment going to... Gonna make you be able to take care of your family is entertainment going to help you take care of your children that you have one day when you become an adult that's what i'm saying is all, all of these things are important and you guys need to understand that you know you all my children bro and i'm gonna make sure that y'all know the same knowledge that i have and uh are able to uh properly you know properly you know um sorry i'm focused on the battle properly you know become the best versions of yourself and so listen i feel like i feel like that's all i really can say man i want people to understand that i used to be the symbiote of toxicity i was the symbol of toxicity i was toxic like the most toxic you could ever imagine like bruh bro i remember back in my the hood crew if you were an enemy man i did whatever it took to destroy you and I was a kid at the time, so obviously whatever it took was childish, you know, raiding, talking crap. But, you know what I'm saying? Things of that nature. I mean, it's a it's a tough it's a tough world, bruh. It's it's and, and the bigger I get, I realize that there's a there's a matrix in every single category of life. You know, there's even a Roblox matrix. There's a group of developers there's a whole, all the developers are all know each other. All the top developers know each other and can contact each other on Roblox. That's the first thing. All the VFX, which is the visual effects developers, they're all in their own little community. Everything is like in its own little bubble. You know what I mean? And it's, it's insane to me. It's insane to me. And then we could go up above the developers are the shareholders, the people that sit in the community and decide, hey, how do we make this company more money? How do we do this? How do we do that? You know, Roblox has kind of made itself self-sufficient because of us constantly trying to innovate and, and create more things. That's why it's such a good platform. But, bro, I want you guys to understand is what a matrix is is basically a group of people that control something. That's basically what it is. And there is a matrix everywhere. Everywhere. It kind of, and it, it, it stuck out to me mainly in the strongest battlegrounds. There was a very toxic person that used to be in this community. And... Um, he went to strongest battlegrounds with the same toxicity and all the youtubers absolutely dunked him i mean it was insane like it was like they all made videos they all just like came out and like clobbered him it was like damn that's that's the matrix right there they they all came together and like let's take this dude out and they they made all their videos and it just he has he's been stripped of his reputation and i don't fear cancellation man like i know there's some clips of me where i'm probably like yo F all of you guys. I don't care about none of y'all. Or there may be some clips. Just stuff that people can take me out of context for. You know what I'm saying? And that's perfectly... There's no Discord messages though. Maybe. But a lot of crap like that could get faked easily. So even my voice can get faked if, if there's somebody who's really desperate enough and to, to do it. 
So it's more like, man, it's insane, dude. It's insane the world we're living in. And uh, it's it's a fun world, but it's a fun world. But damn, it, it's the world's getting more and more competitive, man. Like these, the toleration of certain things are like insane. So all I need is from y'all to be careful. If you guys want to support me, you know the game I'm making. Link in the description, pin comments. I'm going to attempt to safeguard my own community as the best I can. You know, even the Discord server is safe but there are people that mass dm with these bad links so i don't think if you're not allowed to use discord you know join the roblox group i don't recommend you make a discord account without your parents permission you really should be uh the age uh that discord requires because i promise you i i know you think you can handle it and you probably can but it'll change you man it'll change you in a way that i don't want you to be changed i want you guys to stay pure <laughs> as pure as you possibly can i know it's hard to stay pure in a corrupted world where everything is sending you crap that y'all don't need to know about but i try my best bro it's it's hard it's hard man i just think it's important that that we protect the kids bro and there's not enough children being protected like the adults know enough to choose what goes into their mind you know i'm an adult now and even now I'm, i say i'm an adult but my brain doesn't even stop developing for another seven years so, I, I'm still easily manipulated and stuff like that if the right person does to it. So, y'all need to be just careful, man. I love you guys so much. And that's why the main reason why I'm making this video, bro. I love y'all so much. And it's important that you guys... It's important that y'all protect yourselves. Please, man. Take my little thumbnail. <laughs> little thumbnail. I love you guys, man. Peace.